and Davis at the five. Russell is out there with Gilgis Alexander and Atachimura in at the small forward position. We look at the Celtics. They've had some chances in this series but haven't been able to take advantage. Greg, tonight is their last chance. And Kevin, there are no tomorrows uh -uh. unless it's vacation planning. <laughs> but talking to them, they're not ready to concede. They, if they win here, they go home for game six. And if they can win that, anything is possible in a game seven. Well, the basketball IQ of LeBron James is off the charts. So adept at finding ways to get to the line. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. This is about the last guy you want to send to the stripe right now. They keep fouling him, and he keeps making them. Rodman finds Tatum. There's the pass to Smart. Hachimura against Brown. Misses off the left eye. And so James will bring it up to Los Angeles. Here's Russell. Williams with the block. The amazing thing about Williams, yeah, he, he can block shots inside, but he can also block shots out on the perimeter. His ability to play in space means he's more than just a rim protector. Doesn't care where you're shooting from. Offensive rebound. And that one's good by LeBron. You're fighting to keep the possession alive, something this guy does so well. I now I send it over to the sidelines and get a report from David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin. Well, I was able to talk earlier with Boston's head coach. I asked him if he would change anything now that his team's backs are against the wall. He said they'll make a few minor adjustments, but not to expect any sweeping changes. He told me we aren't going to climb out of this hole by changing our stripes. We just have to play a little tougher, a little smarter, and I think we'll be okay. We will see if he's right tonight, Kevin. Back to you. Okay, David, thanks. First quarter, about a minute and a half in. Williams, a screen on LeBron. Pocket six. Tatum against LeBron. And they force the shot clock violation. Great team. And that kind of stifling effort on defense needs another look. And that block was something. It's the playoffs. And every possession and defensive stop matters. He dishes it to Davis. Back to LeBron. Just about two minutes into the game. First quarter of basketball. Uh, just tenacity. That's LeBron James using his length and strength to get to the offensive window. Now Brogdon. Pass to Tatum. Halt the run. Tatum with another miss. Just enough coverage to bother that three-point attempt. LeBron passes to Davis. Just over two and a half minutes played here so far in the first quarter. Tatum looking around. Sinks the three-pointer. Boy, from the moment he entered the league, Jason Tatum has proven to be a knockdown three-point shooter. Huge asset for his team. Here's LeBron. Out to the wing. Here's Hachimura. The three-pointer no good. Celtics trail by five. It's Brogdon on the wing. He's covered by Hachimura. Brogdon picks to Smart. Nice move. Rebound the Lakers. They want that intensity to carry over from that victory on Friday. That mental toughness on the road. The arena was rocking, but they just got down to business and never let up. I thought what really stood out was how dominant they were on the offensive end. That was about as flawless as you could hope for. Well, there's an unpredictability to his offensive game. He is always keeping the defense off balance. Gilgis Alexander against Brogdon. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws. That one on Gilgis Alexander. What you love about Malcolm Brogdon is his consistency. This guy not gifted with incredible athleticism, but he's a knockdown shooter. He competes on the
on the defensive end, one of the smartest players between the lines of an NBA basketball floor. LeBron dishes to Davis. Out left to the wing. Here's Hachimura. Nailed from three-point land. What a smooth catch-and-shoot opportunity from Rui Hachimura. Pretty. And here is Tatum. Williams sets a screen for Brockton. Back to Tatum. Shields over Hachimura. Gilgis Alexander pulls it in. Boy, what a nightmare quarter for this guy. He's playing right into the hands of the defense at this point. The Lakers rebound. Here's James. Off target there. That would have pushed the lead to double digits. And it's smart with the ball for the Boston Celtics. Three-point game. It's stolen by Hachimura. And James throws it down. Well, you understand if you're Rui Hachimura, when to anticipate, make a steal, and get in transition. Nicely done. Tatum against James. Williams has a screen for Brogdon. There's the feed to Williams. And Davis sends it back. And James with a clear path to the hoop. Out to Russell. From the arc. No good. Shot missing. Now Boston takes it the other way. Brown right side. And that one good. Well, at six foot seven, this is a forward Jalen Brown who handles it well, cuts his way right through the defense. LeBron James on the wing, guarded by Smart, and there it is for him. James has got 14 points. And when they go on to him, he has come through big time. You got to keep getting him touches. So the Celtics call timeout. They're first. You look at James. What a contribution. Boy, he's been relentless. And to this point, they haven't had an answer for him on the inside. Let's see if they make some adjustments coming. Celtic shooting a rough 22% so far in this one. They'll go small with LeBron at the four and Davis at the five. Russell is out there with Gilgis Alexander and it's Hachimura in at the three slot. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. Williams passes to Smart. Tatum kicks to Griffin. And the three off target. Yeah, they show effort and aggression in the paint, really right from the tip. Their rebounding edge right now, massive. Yeah, the defender all over them. And let's take a moment here to get your guys' take on scoring so far for Los Angeles. Absolutely dialed in from beyond the arc so far in this one. The defense is surrendering the long-range shot here early on. We've also seen them show a willingness to take advantage of the mid-range opportunities. The defense conceding these looks, and they're cashing in. Yeah, the added muscle Davis has put on, helping him on these tough finishes. Flexing on him there. Back to Brogdon. Outside, smart. He's looking for Williams and finds him. And pulls out with that assist. Nice delivery there in traffic. Griffin against LeBron. Williams with the block. Tatum against Russell. Tatum passes to Smart. Up and in on the way. Well, if there's any player in the league who relishes contact, it's Marcus Smart. You want to play physical? Oh, yeah. I like that. Here's James. It doesn't go for him. Good tee by Williams. Tatum with it. And Hachimura picks him up defensively. Tatum down low. He's against Hachimura. And there's the bucket from Tatum. Once Jason Tatum has the ball in his hands in the painted area, this guy will power through. He'll put it up and over you if necessary. He knows how to score it. All the officials are all over that one. These are his third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. And he knocks down the first one. Both free throws good from James. I think, guys, the pursuit of greatness is what distinguishes LeBron James. Make no mistake, he wants to be considered the GOAT, the greatest of all time when it's all said and done. 
Tatum passes to Griffin. LeBron with the ball. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by James. To the middle. Here's Brogdon. And he jams it after taking the nice feet on the run. Lakers leading by 21. Outside, Gilgis Alexander. Inside. And finished off by LeBron. Yeah, LeBron James shouldering the load offensively. He has done this from the time he entered the league. For Boston, they've gone four of six in the field here in the second. They double him with LeBron. Griffin finds Smart. It's Brogdon on the wing. And the rejection by LeBron. Davis against Williams, and they double up James. Davis has the open look. Yes, it's James picking up the assist. Davis has got five points now this quarter. This guy knows where everyone is at all times. LeBron James makes the spectacular assist routine. Time call here. The Celtics decide to talk it over. Spins. Here's Tatum. Tatum draws the double. For three, Brockton. They get it back. Williams. That's it. He's got two made now, and he's shooting two for three. They are just killing him on the interior. Here's James. And LeBron throws it down hard. And what an explosive finisher LeBron is. Rocking the rim whenever he goes up like that. And that's life above the rim. Courtesy of our AT&T 5G Slam Cam. I'll tell you, you hate to pin this on one person, but his inefficiencies at the offensive end are holding this group back. And haven't we seen that a few times today, guys? I mean, their defense has got to have a little bit more toughness about it. Outside, smart. Down low, here's Tatum. And slam dunk by Tatum. Well, you have to admire how Smart is running this offense right now. He has a knack for spotting open teammates. Russell with a wide-open look. And the Lakers hit again from deep. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket, coming off a pretty pass. Smart on the wing. He's guarded by Russell. Six on the shot clock. Smart against Russell. Smart misses. Boy, nine times out of ten, that's going in. I'm sure he surprised himself with the miss. Here's James, and LeBron throws it down. Boy, over two decades now, LeBron James, power, style, finish, grace, you name it. Rodged in the pass to Smart. Outside, Griffin. No good on the three. That's not his spot, but given the lack of defense, you'd like to see him knock that one down. Let's it go from 11. And Boston with the rebound. Well, seized up just a little bit at the last second. That's one he normally converts. Brogdon with it. In the corner, it's Griffin. And the rejection by James. Well, just impressive defense by LeBron James. Such a good feel on that in the floor. Track that shot all the way. Pretty dime there. The kind of ball movement coaches love to see. For Boston, they've gone 6 of 14 shooting here in the second. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now, you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Griffin kicks to Brogdon. Shot clock at six. Here are the NBA's top scorers during this postseason as shown on the 2K leaderboard. LeBron James second.
and he's taken off on a tremendous scoring streak at the perfect time. I mean, obviously, he's established himself as a career playoff performer. And Los Angeles with some changes. Muhammad Bob. Eight seconds left in the first half of basketball. Outside Williams. And here's Tatum for three. The shot comes out, and so it's Los Angeles. I know teams love to rely on the three these days. Looking at how the Celtics... And that is our... Time for more of the NBA Finals on 2K Sports. What a time of year. What can you say, LeBron James? What an impressive effort today. And he's been a monster in this game, throwing down some huge dunks. And I wasn't sure the rim would even survive in that first half. Oh, his power is unbelievable. An intimidating force when he's at his best. On the floor for Boston. Again on the wing, he's joined by Brown. In the post, it's Tatum and Williams. And it's Smart in at the one. LeBron with it. Out guarded by Smart. From deep three-point range, that shot off. The Celtics go the other way with it. Brockton outside. Now here's Williams. Brown outside. And it's good assisting on the play was Williams. Brown's got the first basket of the third quarter for the Celtics. L.A. has gotten the three-point bug tonight. They've taken 15 shots outside the arc. Six of 15. Count the basket. And LeBron makes that insane dribble move look so effortless. What a showman he is. Oh, what an impressive dribble drive. That replay brought to you by Mobile One. It's all about the ability to get two feet in the paint, whether it's creating for a teammate or for yourself. Tatum against James. Tatum down low. And the rejection by James. Hachimura the pass to LeBron. Driving in, and he could not get that one to go. A lot of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. Imagine LeBron gets a step on you. It must be like a steam engine coming at you to the rim. All you can do is foul him. And so he makes both from the line. The Celtics have gone one of three since starting the second half. Brogdon outside. Back to Brown. That one misses. Davis with some nice D. All right, time now to pick it up. You're one for four, and you certainly don't want to give your opponent momentum. Well, I'll tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. He's made all six of his tries at the line so far. Both shots good from the strike. Two minutes gone in this third quarter now. Pass to Brogdon. There's the three. The shot's good. Brown making the play. Brogdon's got eight points. Understand this. If Malcolm Brogdon is on the three-point line, you better get a hand up and contest. Nicely done. To the paint. To the wing on the left. Here's Hachimura. Trying to answer back, but that three is off the mark. And it's smart with the ball for the Boston Celtics. Passes to Brogdon. Williams, a screen on Gilgis Alexander. Brogdon kicks to Smart. Off target from outside. He is just not taking smart shots out there. A pattern he has fallen into tonight. As will find James. And he banks in the layup. James has got 34. The defense is always going to give a level of attention to LeBron. He's able to shake off the contact and get into his shooting. Tatum passes to Brogdon. A three ball. A shot missing. 
So Los Angeles will take it the other way. I'll tell you, this guy is doing absolutely everything he can to get himself going, but the team is struggling because he's struggling. Impeccable from the line since halftime. Pretty much automatic tonight at the line, eight for eight. Pritchard, he's checked in for Smart. And both free throws good for LeBron. Boston's gone two of five with a three-point shot since coming out of the break. The pass to Brown. Williams, a screen on Hachimura. From the stripe, Brown, good. Brown's got five points now this quarter. Well, this is where having a tighter handle helps Jalen Brown in pick and roll play, just gets to his spot and scores it. The offensive rebound, Williams with the block. This has not been a good period for this guy. Out of sync, not letting the game come to him. He's got to settle down and make shots. Tatum passes to Williams. Here's Pritchard. Back to Williams. And finished off by Williams. You know, something that Williams does so well, as soon as he has inside position, he just goes for the finish. Here's LeBron, and the rejection by Tatum. In the corner, it's Brogdon. The shot's good, Brown making the play. Brown's got three assists in the game. The drive by James, and James throws it down hard. If LeBron gets speed at the rim, it takes a couple of steel walls to slow him down. And even then, he'll finish the job. Nice angle on that replay with the AT&T 5G slam cam. The three from Tatum. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Hachimura's got four rebounds in this game. He takes it in and finished off by LeBron. And LeBron James wins his battle right at the beginning. Explosive first step. The Celtics have gone 5 of 12 from the field since the third quarter got underway. Tatum passes to Brogdon. They double-team Brogdon. And here's Tatum for three. And now the fast break. Hachimura with the ball. And LeBron throws it down. Yeah, they're rolling right now. That lead continues to grow. And one of the things that's helped that is they're getting it done on both ends. Terrific focus on offense, and they're locked in defensively. And it's Williams finishing it off. Brown has improved as a setup guy. That pass was on time and on target. Gilgis Alexander passes to LeBron. Hachimura kicks to LeBron. Pass to Russell. Fires the three. And Boston with the rebound. And on an open look like that, he's very gifted at making the weak coverage pay. Tatum passes to Pritchard. Williams with the ball. Brown outside. Nice ball movement by Boston. Just five to shoot. The three from Tatum. LeBron grabs the miss. LeBron's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Well, he hasn't proven to be much of a floor spacer for them. He had the one three, but that was back in the first half. Pass to Brogdon. Brown outside. To the middle. Here's Tatum. And they call the foul, so a chance at the line for one more coming up. I love when Jason Tatum is aggressive to score the basketball. He does a tremendous job keeping his focus. Griffin's checked in for the Celtics. Horford comes in for Brown. Los Angeles has gotten off to a very slow start from three-point range in the second half. They're 0 for 4. James fires from way outside. Kicks it out to Beasley. At three off the mark. Celtics have gone seven for 16 the second half from the field, shooting a bit under 50%. Outside, Horford to the left side wing. Pritchard, the shot's good on the assist by Horford. Well, this is an example of the court awareness we talk about with Al Horford. This guy's a very willing passer. Gilgis Alexander passes to LeBron. There's the triple. The rebound by Brogdon. Brogdon's got four rebounds now tonight. Tatum on the wing.
inside. Horford. Tatum trying to break free. Wow, through the contact, and that three almost went in. So he'll go to the line for three free throws. And a chance for just a second to check out the scoring breakdown for the Lakers. I like this throwback approach they're taking, looking to score high percentage shots in the paint. And so far, it's working. I think another thing that's striking here tonight, the ball movement is incredible. Again and again, they're making smart passes to ready shooters. Trying to end the drought, and LeBron throws it down. I mean, he's just been brilliant today, guys, and it was the same exact story last time out. Boston shooting around 44% in this third quarter. Now a timeout called by Boston. And no doubt, Coach wants them to shore up their interior defense. I think right now they're giving up way too many easy looks. That is a recipe for disaster. Your Wizards new dance team, give them some love. Here's Pritchard. He's guarded by Schroeder. Outside, Horford. Here's Pritchard. Boston again missing. The Lakers shooting 35% or so in the third quarter. Whatever they're trying is not working. Well, Mo Bamba, no doubt. LeBron James with the assist. Here's Brogdon. 11 points in the game. They double team Brogdon. And Gallinari kicks to Brogdon. Here's Horford. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Wow, they've made every free throw here in the second half. And this is his second trip to the line in the game. Guys, I know we've discussed this many times, but I don't think statistics really reflect Al Warford's true value. This guy is a terrific player and a pro's pro. And so it looks like the Lakers will retain possession here. Vanderbilt's checked in for the Lakers. Vanderbilt. Now James, he's got 44. Here's Pritchard, passes it to Brogdon. Now Gallinari. And there's the pass to Brogdon. Horford with the screen on Beast, just four to shoot. Brogdon finds Horford, and good! Coming on the assist by Brogdon. Horford's got five points now this quarter. Malcolm Brogdon, just so savvy. He's got size, strength, and vision. Nicely done. Schroeder outside. Trains it from beyond the arc. This is as pure a shooter as there is. You've got to stay connected or it's a problem. And so it's Brogdon with it. He brings it up for the Celtics. Pass to Gallinari. Releases. He trains the turnaround jump shot. Gallinari's got his first basket of the night. Well, some contact there on the shot, but Danilo Gallinari, much improved upper body strength, maintains his focus nicely done. He muscles it in through the contact, and they call the foul. He's on his way to the free throw line. Well, you love his effort level, Davis right? Particularly when it's winning time. He is going for the finish. Davis has checked in for Vanderbilt and then for Boston. Williams is checked in for Griffin, and Marcus Smart is subbed in for Pritchard. Smart passes to Horford. 109 left here in the third quarter. It's stolen by Schroeder. LeBron outside, and they double up James. Stolen by Smart. It's Brogdon, top of the key. Pass to Horford. He blocks it again! A, a defensive stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Greg protecting the rim. Love the hustle. And that's going to be a treble. A sensational block that definitely deserves another look. <laughs> well, they didn't make it this far by giving up easy ones. And now their defense is in overdrive. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. Beasley against Brogdon. Takes a shot at the elbow. 
tries from 10. That's good from Horford on the assist from Brogdon. Horford's got 10. If you want to talk about an NBA player who has poise and vision, that's Malcolm Brogdon doing work with the pass. That is nicely done. Well, those are the kinds of moves that distinguish LeBron from every other small forward that has ever played this game. And Davis sends it back. And for the ball out of bounds, Davis touched it last. And here's Brockton from the arc. No good on the shot. And so it's LeBron James making things happen for Los Angeles. Going on an absolute rampage, piling in the points. He dictated the pace of the entire... And while we can now, let's take a look at today's State Farm assist of the game. And how about the big fella here showing us he's got some point guard skill here with the tremendous setup. I'll tell you, in today's game, you want... And we've got a lineup change for the Lakers. Boston making some changes. They'll go small with LeBron at the four and Davis at the five. Gilgis Alexander out there with Russell. And it's Hachimura at the three, the small four. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. And he wanted everybody in the building to feel that ferocity. And we did. Yeah. And we, we felt it. <laughs> Even over here, we felt it. Brown feeling out a bit. Shoots over Gilgis Alexander. Wow, came this close to a four-point play. Head right to the line for three free throws. That's on LeBron James. And some changes here for the Celtics. Blake Griffin comes in for Williams. And it's Pritchard in for Tatum. At the line for three. And he makes all three. LA's gone one or two from three-point range here in the fourth. LeBron outside. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. At his size, LeBron is a handful inside, and sometimes you can't help but foul him to try and prevent that easy bucket. James. Really getting after the defense since the break. He's so hard to keep off the line when he pushes the action. Both free throws good from James. The Celtics have gone 4 of 10 here in the final period. Not the time to go cold. Down against Gilgis Alexander. Not loose. It's stolen by Davis. Floats it up for James. Oh, and they get in the way of the alley-oop. Not to be. Good play defensively. Hachimura against Brown. Passes it to Golinari. Six to shoot. Horford with the screen on Hachimura. Here's Pritchard. Again, the miss by the Celtics. For Los Angeles, they've gone 8 of 11 from the field in the final period. Great shooting down the stretch. And finished off by Davis. A terrific leaper with incredible height. Davis is a dunk machine. And so it's Gallinari with it. They'll bring it up to Boston. And finished off by Horford. Sometimes a player is born with a passer's mindset. He deals it with conviction. And he lobs it up toward the rim, and it's Davis with the jam. And in terms of size, not your typical center, but man, he plays as big as any of them, thanks to that terrific leaping ability. And they double up Brown. Alinari on the wing. Back to Brown. The pass to Pritchard. Pulls up. High post. The shot's good. Brown making the play. Brown's got his seventh assist in the game. Have to love the ball distribution. Keep everyone involved. Loads it up for Davis. With center size and guard right skill, maybe can get any shot he wants. For Boston, they've gone 6 of 13. So just about 46% on their field goal attempts are in the court. Brown outside. From deep. 
Rebounded by the Lakers. Davis has got 10 rebounds here tonight. So active. LeBron outside. Trying to go for an alley-oop, but excellent defense and anticipation there to stop it. Brown against Gilgis Alexander. Outside, Horford. Back to Brown. Five on the clock. Inside. Fades back. And Griffin with the score. The assist by Horford. Horford's got his third assist on the night. Blake Griffin beating very solid defense with better offense. You'll love that assertive mentality. LeBron, that's a two-pointer. They grab their own miss. Davis, and then jam down as it goes right over Blake Griffin. Oh, my goodness. AD wanted them to feel that one. Davis boosts his whole team with that explosiveness. Pass to Brown. Takes the three. Anthony Davis with the rebound. Los Angeles has gone one and two from three-point range here in the fourth. To the inside. Here's James. And finished off by LeBron. And no doubt about it, in order for them to be successful, he has got to be a catalyst when it comes to scoring. The Celtics have gone seven to 16 from the field here in the fourth. That's about 43%. Out to the right wing. Alinari surveying the D. Pass to Pritchard. From past the arc. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. LeBron. And it's blocked. And so it looks like the Lakers will retain possession here. And Los Angeles with some changes. Muhammad Bamba comes in for Rui Hachimura. And Dennis Schroeder subbed in for Russell. Smarts checked in for the Celtics. To the paint. Schroeder dishes to James. Kicks it to Bamba. Just five to shoot. And they double up James. Here's Gilgis Alexander. Wow, Shane Gilgis Alexander quick off the speed. Defense doesn't have time to react. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. LeBron against Gallinari. Doesn't go for him. So it's the Lakers now. James, the pass to Davis. And it's Davis finishing it off. And it's been a productive night for Davis, staying so active on offense and taking every chance to score. And here's Smart. 127 left in the fourth. Austin needs to get off a shot. Bamba with the block. Well, this is one of Bamba's big time strengths. Send it back, Mo. And wow, that's the end of an epic journey taken by both these teams in unbelievable fashion. Get the NBA title rings ready, folks, for the Lakers. As one sided as it gets today, you know. There were some dominant moments in there, about every facet of this game for that team. Yeah, I mean, Kevin, it's hard to think of what didn't go right for them. Uh, game planning by the coaches, execution by the players, everything was just on target. And they are just moments away from lifting the trophy thanks to a rousing performance here in Game 5. Yeah, it was really just a remarkable effort tonight, and you can see how much this title means to this team. They are extremely deserving champions and they are going to enjoy this celebration for quite a while. And what a tremendous standout performance it was for LeBron. This guy putting on a passing clinic. If you want to know how to run an offense, roll back the tape from this evening. James misses. And so it's Gallinari with it. He'll bring it up for the Celtics. And James picks up the foul. That's his fourth foul of the contest. In the corner, Tatum with it. And slam dunk by Tatum. Great scorers need easy opportunities to pile up those points. Tatum above the rim and the nice finish. 
James with it. And that's it, folks. The Los Angeles Lakers have won it all. Wow. All the travel, all the practices, all the meetings, all the games, wins and losses, the emotion, the exhaustion culminating into tonight. And whenever you win the NBA championship, there is a level of accomplishment and excitement that really can't be matched. But pretty amazing to have accomplished this goal. The celebration is here, and this place is going crazy. The bench loves it. The fans obviously overjoyed. This is one of those moments these players will never forget. Let's go to the floor. Here is Adam Silver presenting the Larry O'Brien Trophy. Victorious. The NBA champion. Congratulations to the whole organization and, of course, this incredible team. This Larry O'Brien Trophy and I believe this suitcase are yours. You're Bill Russell, Finals MVP. What an awesome moment for him in front of his fans. You love to see hard work rewarded. And that is the ultimate validation. Now you folks have been with us every step of the way. From all of us at 2K Sports, Thanks for watching. We'll see you next season.